my dear student today i'm going to start the discussion about that java expression actually expression in java are of various types but this is that topic related to java expression that means so what is that expression so we will discuss that thing so we start our discussion about expression at first what is that expression if you anybody will ask that what is expression if you have any prior knowledge in any programming language so expression is actually that uh, we can say that valid combination of operands so valid combination of operands and operators what is an expression expression is a valid combination of operands and operators so actually which type of combination which will give some result that means when we will evaluate it it will give one result so that is known as expression that is known as expression its result will be of type arithmetical or logical that means when you will do some calculation with the expression it will give some numerical value or otherwise it will give that true or false type of result that means logical result so it is known as expression now we go for example so first we write that valid expression and next is that invalid expression so valid expression or invalid both we will write then we will understand comparatively so which one is valid and which one is invalid so because valid combination of operands and operator is needed so 2 plus 5 or 2 comma 5 so 2 plus 5 we can do some calculation arithmetical calculation that is plus addition is that and 2 comma 5 there is no any operation there is no comma operator will perform any operation so you see here that 2 is one first operand 5 is also another operand plus plus is that operator to perform addition and 5 is operand 2 in this expression so this is valid expression so because it is having that two operands with operator in such a way in such an order that it can give some result so invalid expression 2 is also here first operand comma is that one operator but not to perform any operation so comma will not perform any arithmetical operation or not any logical expression and 5 is also that operand 2 so so what is that proper result it will give so see here that a valid expression will give that result 7 and it result is not possible because operators is invalid so due to arithmetical operator so addition operator it will give the result 7 so this is the expression we go for the next expression type expression type we can categorize according to the use of operands or operands data type or operators so first of all we will discuss use of operators that means which type of operator you are using that type of operand expression will be known as so if you will use arithmetical operator it will known as arithmetical expression so like that we will discuss that Oper according to the use of operands data type that means if we will use int long float double care so which type of data type we are using with operands so that type of expression it is known as now understand one by one according to the use of operator so arithmetical expression or logical or boolean expression arithmetical expression is that you see here that uh, giving arithmetical expression is that uh, with arithmetic operators that means the expression which is having only arithmetic operators is known as arithmetic expression the uh, relational or boolean operators are used then that expression is known as logical or boolean expression second one is that according to the use of <coughs> operands data type that means pure expression where same type of operands are used that means all the operands having the same data type then it is known as pure expression in pure or mixed expression means name suggest as like mixed expression means so where mix up of two different data types of operands that means when used with different types of operands 
in an expression that is known as impure or mixed expression. We give one example and you understand that. So expression types, arithmetic expression or Boolean or logical expression. Arithmetic expression results as arithmetic value. Operators are used, arithmetic operators and it performs some result like this. So this expression having all that arithmetic operators are here. So 3 into 8, 24, 24 divided by 2, 12 and then it will give 37 minus 10, 27. Logical or Boolean expression results as a true or false. Operators are used and or equals to equals to not equals to greater than less than greater than equals to less than equals to comparison. That means which will give the result as a true or false. Here 10 greater than 5 or 7 less than 2. So 10 greater than 5 is true. So it will give true or 7 less than 2. It will give false. So true or false. So resultant value will be true. So this is Boolean or logical expression. Now we go, go for second one that according to the use of operands data type. So first is that pure expression. Second is that impure expression. Pure expression result data type is same as a operands data type. And operands data type are same data type. That means all the operands will have the same data type. You see here the 20, 10, 2, 3. All operands are having the same type of data type integer. Impure expression, mixed expression, all results and data type is not fixed. Result data type is not fixed because different data types are used. So which data type result will be there that is not known. So operators, operands and data type are different. So 10.5, 20 into 5.25, 200. So here you see 20 and 200 are of integer type and 10.5 and 5.25 are of double date types. So, so here that's why it is not predictable that which type of result will be there. So type of result we will discuss later how to find out in pure or impure or mixed expression. We go for the next expression evaluation. So first we will discuss that uh, how to evaluate the expression so of any type that first we go for pure expression. In a pure expression so how to evaluate that expression so according to the precedence of operator and all so we will discuss that precedence of operator and hierarchy of data type in next tutorial. So this one you understand one example here given sort a variable having 5 b variable having 2 and c is that c is equal to a plus b and c is equal to a slash b here semicolon will be but you understand this is that expression so what is that result a plus b a plus b both are of sort so result will be of sort type so you understand it so a plus b will be produce the result will produce the result c1 of sort type because both are having of short type sort integer type so here a slash b will produce the result 2 of sort type because 5 by 2 will result 2.5 in float type but both are having that sort type integer type sort integer type that's why its the result will be of 2 only not that 2.0 and not that 2.5 okay so this type of result evaluation is done in pure expression later we will discuss that expression evaluation that how to according to the hierarchy of the operators precedence of operator so we will find out that expression results now another example we see that in pure expression another example is that suppose we have to find out that 100 by 11 100 and 11 both are of integer type so result will be 9 but actually we will get that in mathematics when we are doing this result will not be 9 it will be of float type it will be a fractional type but in a computer both are of integer type so we will reuse that 9 because both are of 100 and 11 both are of integer type so now go for next you understand that same I have said next is that pure expression third example that x is equal to 5.5 y is equal to 2.5 so here given that expression 
so but in expression you see 5.5 x having y having 2.5 both are having double type and 2.0 also double type that means all are having of double type that means same type that's why this is known as pure expression in second one also like that so you see that in which way it will give the result 10.5 and it in which way it will give the result 15.0 but you understand all the operands of the double type so result will be of double type in this now we discuss about that impure expression or mixed expression so one example that giving here 20 or 5.25 so 1.25 this one combination of so 20 is of integer type and raised to both 5.25 and 1.25 are of double type so data type of the result is considered according to the hierarchy or precedence of the data type that is which data type will occupy higher spacing in memory so that we will discuss in next tutorial but you understand this is impure or mixed expression that's why in mixed expression it is not predictable that's uh, easily that's which type of result will be that we have to carry out we have to consider that's uh, which which data types are used and uh, resultant value how we have to find out okay